You didn't see me sweating. I'm not sweaty at all. I'm totally unsweaty. I am, uh... I am not nervous. What? 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 <laughs> Thank you for the fart. Thank you for the resub, CZ. Oh, you're doing the Prime Gaming subscription. Good, you're using that. You're taking good advantage of that. I hope that um, you're doing well. I hope that all of y'all are do doing well. Hello, everyone in chat. CZ, Zizon. I hope that I'm pronouncing that right. Senti, Cabal. I think that's everyone so far who has uh, chatted. What? How are y'all doing tonight? Oh, you leave for home tomorrow? Excite! The time for Cabal stream to start again is soon. Thank you for the hat. But um, I am doing quite well. Today's been a really busy day. I have done a lot today. I have spent a lot of money because we uh, me and my roommates went out uh, shopping for like food groceries um, I shopped for some computer parts so <laughs> I had to redo my expenses been a good vacation happy to return home I'm glad that you got some time off you got a good amount of time off it was a few weeks right like two weeks uh, and I'm glad that you enjoyed it it won't let you re use redeems? Wait, why? Why is that? That's so strange. Thank you, Draken! Thank you for the hat pat. I hope you're doing all right. But, um... It looks like I'm looking off to the side when I'm, when I'm not. One second, let me move my mic. It's probably because of where my mic is. But, um... I hope you guys are having a good Friday night. I am feeling good, I think. I think I'm feeling good. Um, to give a little context, I have been building my new PC uh, with the help of my roommates, and it is almost done. Like, we are at the very end. We need to put in one more thing and plug it into power and test it, and then it will be finished, and it will be really powerful. I'm gonna stay for a little bit, but I'm gonna have to sleep soon. Sorry, don't no need to apologize, Easy. You have work tomorrow. You gotta wake up early. But I appreciate you stopping by. But um, today we're gonna be playing some more Uke. It will be our last Uke stream, and uh, we'll just try to explore a little bit and get some more events. Um. Hopefully we can get all the events listed in the wiki, but some of them require random chance, so I don't know if we'll get those. And I will be keeping the stream to under two hours, two hours or less, just because I want to finish my PC. I want to finish my PC! I'm so excited! <laughs> I want to finish it tonight so I can like get it booted up and like get Windows installed on it and stuff. New PC vibes, yeah! <laughs> You're not supposed to suffocate, CZ! No! Please! We need you to breathe! Your face is literally uncovered! That's the whole point of a burrito! <laughs> CZ choking on air. <laughs> is it because he's a cowboy? He's um, ascended our mortal realm. He cannot just subsist on air anymore. He needs to subsist on like peanut butter crackers. You're putting a pillow over your face? No. Cabal is only providing a blanket. <laughs> but um, let's see. Let's get to it. I uh, today's been a thing. Today's been a good thing, but. Do y'all ever feel like so much has happened in a day that you kind of feel overwhelmed by it? That's kind of me right now. Like it's good stuff, but it's just a lot of stuff. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, it's kind of like you need to like process all of it. Let me see. Let me get the screen capture set up. Well, the window capture. Because it's still on Wednesdays. 
We're gonna be finishing two games um, soon. We're gonna be finishing Uke, and we're gonna be finishing Love at First Sight tomorrow. That'll be fun. Life is for Love at First Sight has been giving me some weird vibes in some of the scenes, but overall, it's pretty cute. All right, that should be good. Oh wait, no, one more thing. All right, there it is. There's the game. That's also me when one thing happens as well. That's totally fair. I'm like that if I have to do something on consecutive days. Yeah, that, that's that's me too. I have pretty much been busy for most of this week. <sighs> and I'm gonna be busy for the next two days as well. So uh, hopefully I'm going back home tomorrow night. So hopefully I'll have some time to chill a little bit on Sunday morning, but we'll see. I'm going back to my mom's house, I mean. A lot of VNs give off weird vibes, but cute girls, yeah. Uh, VN writers just gotta put their fetish into everything they write. Yeah. Yeah, that's the same thing with me, Cabal. I need time to rest. To, like, just do nothing and process everything that's happened. Welcome back, Zizon! D did I pronounce that right? Is it Zizon or Zizon? Zizon? Because I feel like I want to call you that, as opposed to Inferno. I want to switch it up. Alright, let's get this. Oh yeah, also, what did you get for a snack? That's a given when you're around? Alright, did you just call Zizon a snack? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know about you. Are you looking like a snack right now? Are you looking like a bag of chips? I just want to crunch into you. Zizon, but as always, people say it many different ways. Oh, okay, I just want to know how you prefer to say it. So that's good to know. Okay, so. Also, is the volume okay on this? Let's go. Okay, that looks good. So, one of the events that I want to do... Oh shit, I just accidentally closed the video. Is the is a CG, like a full screen um, illustrate, illustrated thing. It's like an illustration of a character. So, first, I have to figure out how to get to Industrial Wasteland. Head out to the other side of the station. Different train. How do we get to the train station again? I forget. I'm looking at the guide right now. Gotta give some positive energy to counteract the b bad vibes. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait. <laughs> I've been pronouncing it wrong. Oh! Actually, Zion, but someone else said it differently and I liked it better? Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I'm looking at a YouTube video right now. <laughs> yeah, what bad vibes? That, that was what I was ask, gonna ask. Me? CZ, come on! You're not bad vibes. What the fuck? If you call yourself a bad vibe one more time, I'm gonna turn you into a bad vibe. <laughs> I don't even know what kind of fucking uh, intimidation technique that was. I'm trying to figure out what this person is doing. This is an area that I've never been to before, so this will be good. This will be a good thing to explore. Let's just try to get to this area first and see. Is this where we want to be? Yes, this is. 
It's neat to hear all the ways people think it's said. Oh, okay. At least you enjoy it. Roast turkey sandwich, grapes, and chip. Ooh, that sounds good. Chainsaw? Yeah. Let me get out the chainsaw. Fuck. <laughs> I will take... <laughs> Oh, it was your dinner too? I had, um... I've been saying how my roommate ha has been making, like, really good dinners. He made chicken tikka masala today. It was so fucking good. I can't wait to have it for, uh, for brunch. For breakfast tomorrow. It was really good. I love just, like, mixing rice with sauce. I'm getting sushi tomorrow? Oh hell yeah. What's your what's your favorite kind of sushi? I like trim tempura. Yeah, chicken tikka masala is really good. He he like marinated it and and like seasoned the ticket chicken himself. He made the sauce. It was amazing. Wow 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 wow. Ooh. I like all kinds of sushi. Haven't had one I didn't like. Oh, really? Damn. You have a... You have a... What, what do you call it? A wide palate or something? Good night, Sazy! I hope you have a good sleep. Thank you for stopping by. And again, you are not a bad vibe. Fuck that. <laughs> a little fart for the road. Yeah, so we need to go here. Is it this area? Oh, maybe. Oh. Oh, I think we were already here before. I think we need to use this. Oh, huh. So that's what we needed. I also like trying new foods. Oh, who put that there? Who put those people there? So what do we need to do? Does it need to be set to 13? Oh, it does. Oh, so we conduct the trains that way. I see. That's interesting. And then we get to this train. I think this is the one that we need to get on? And then we're here! Oh, this is interesting. <laughs> Do something with all these fly crisps? You could, um, you could request a game. You could request that I play a game. I think this is industrial wasteland, so there is a person here. There are actually two, two events here. Which is nice. So there is going to be an NPC walking around. And we have to find her. She um, spawns randomly. Not sure what I would ask her though. I think about it. I have like 12k. Oh yeah. Um, if you guys have any suggestions for redeems, feel free to suggest them. Um, I kind of wanted to do some stuff similar to what Koro does. They do a bunch of videos. Oh, look, it's a little TV room. Um, that Like videos that show up. Apparently, there's randomly an NPC in here.
<laughs> Gotta waste their electricity. Now that I actually live in my own place and have to pay all the utilities, I am now a lot more mindful of how much power I use because <laughs> I need to pay for it. I mean, like, I was kind of mindful of it before in my old house, but now I'm even more mindful. There's supposed to be a ghost in here. Watching TV. What sort of video redeems and sound redeems to put on my channel as well? Yeah, it's like there's so many that you can do. <laughs> I like that sound of like the music just starting and then ending. What are the chances of the ghost appearing? I would like to know. Oh. There it is. I like the music. Oh! <laughs> I was watching TV, you turn it off, and it's like, oh! Aww. Also, I still have my chainsaw. Let's put that away. <laughs> okay, I'll turn I'll turn it back on. My little guy. Alright, so that was one of the things. Now we need to find this NPC walking around. Here she is, I think. Oh wait, never mind. This is a different one. Maybe? Because the, there's another NPC with the helmet on. Apparently... Interacting with her while having the cloud buffer equipped will do something? Oh. So, apparently she's kind of like Mafudako in Yume Nikki. Give a romantic review of this NPC. She looks like she needs some love. I'll give her a kiss. I'll give her a little kiss. Oh, what's this? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's just in the corner there. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> you you um <laughs> that was a reaction to the kiss thing. Oh, just a little bit late. I think it's still fine. Okay, so where we wanna go is up there. But we don't necessarily want to go there yet. We want to find this other NPC that's walking around. We'll get to you later, girl. Thank you for the head pat! Wait, we were just here, right? Oh, the ghost wasn't here before. Ah! Hmm, pet the frange. The frange enjoys the pets. Here it is. Here's this girl. So she's showing us a bug. Thank you for the hat bat. Okay, interacting with her three times makes her disappear. And there's the bug that she was holding. We squished the bug. Bye bye, bug. Your blood is beautiful. Plart the from big. The. The worm girl. Yeah, I really do like seeing glimpses of like the art that the game developers make because some of the game developers are really talented artists and I really enjoy their art. Like, um, Moriwo, Moriwo for Yume Tuki, the, one of the devs on Yume Tuki, their art is very nice. Very, very nice. Now let's find that green girl. Get her to teleport us to the place that we want. We're actually getting quite... We're getting quite l lucky. After this, there's like... Two more events that we can go to. That are listed. Okay. But, uh, how are you guys doing? How are your nights going? As we try to- oh no, bug. I'm sorry, bug. Oh, 
You're doing okay? I'm glad you're doing okay. You're doing good? That's good. Y'all doing anything this weekend? Any... It doesn't even have to be something interesting, but just chilling. Listen to music. Art. Opinions on Uke, by the way? I really like it. It's a really good game. Only thing that I'm kind of iffy about is the... <laughs> is the afro effect. It's just kind of... I'll give it a pass because it was made by a Japanese person who doesn't really have much context on that kind of stuff, but... Doing pretty good, just enjoying the stream. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I'm glad that y'all are here hanging out with me. Chilling. Returning home tomorrow, though I think I've said that already. Yeah, you did mention it, but I appreciate the... The response. I like it, yeah! I really like the art, I like the events. I like the concept. I like the kind of backstory it paints. Uh, for New Day. Okay, where the fuck is this girl? Girl, come on. Mostly chilling, doing final push for affiliate? Oh, hell yeah. I wish you luck with that. Uh, what- what's the stuff that you have left? Like, the- Is it the average viewers? The- I forget exactly what they needed. Average viewers, followers number? Is there anything else? Always enjoy chilling in your chat, hence why I got a job here. Yeah, you got the moderator job, the volunteer. Volunteer position. Yeah, it is an interesting game. Definitely a standout among Yume Nikki fan games. I just wish it didn't have the big maze. Big in the, <laughs> the um, does this have ghosts too? The big hell maze. They streamed in a week. Oh, okay. Stream two more days since I wasn't feeling well. My time got cut short and now I'll have to stream three days in a row. Oh, yeah, it really is that final push, but I wish you luck, Zyzone. Where is this girl? It was so easy to find her before. Hmm, maybe I'm just going around in a circle. Because I, I find that when I try to search Yume Nikki fan game worlds um, without doing like a full scan of the area, I tend to go, go um, along the same routes unconsciously. Oh, shorter streams? Okay. Yeah, no problem. Is she just not here? You might encounter an NPC similar to Mafudako. Might. Does that mean that she, sometimes she's not here? I'm reading the wiki, by the way. That's how it describes this NPC. At least, at least this area is interesting. It's not just like... A wide expanse of nothingness with a picture in the background. I get really tired after streams. I feel you, Zyzon. It's the same for me, too. Like, usually after streams, I have to, like, regroup myself and just kind of, like, do nothing for a bit. Although, after this stream, I'm going to be uh, finishing up the build for my computer with my roommate. So hopefully I won't be too tired for that, but that's why I'm gonna try and keep the stream a bit shorter. We'll see. Well... 
Thank you! Yeah, all we need to do is just put the GPU in, uh, hook it up to the power supply, and then we'll boot up the computer and see how it runs. See if, uh, do like some load tests and stuff. Thank you for the hot pot! I'm so excited to use this computer, honestly. I'm so excited because all my life I've been using laptops, which are, f are fine. It's just I've heard that like an, an actual like PC build is just leagues above what you can get with a laptop. You almost fell asleep. <laughs> I'm glad you're chilling. They leave you borderline hyper, but also physically tired? Yeah. You sleep in the stream all the time? Yeah, Zaizan has been like, oh my god, I need a nap. This has me so comfy. Well, that's totally fine. Also, we're in this world, and the music is honestly kind of... I can see how it could lull people to sleep as well. <laughs> Comfy frange. Just imagine like holding a frange plush or something while you go to sleep. Do a little squish. Like a really good pillow. A good body pillow. Except I'm not that big. Where the heck is this NPC? I swear I don't think she exists anymore. I need a frange plushie. Yeah. That'll be nice. You could? Yo, if you do, if you ever do, that'll be pretty awesome. I'd want to see it. You have a frog, uh, a fox plushie. You just need a frog one. Yeah, get like a round frog. Round frog plushie. I'm sure they sell those. You have the skill set for it? Wait, you can sew too? You can make stuffed animals? You can sculpt? You can paint? You can make stuffed animals? Damn. You made some of your friends? That's so nice. There's a species of frog that will enter a symbiotic relationship with tarantulas. Frogs protect the tarantula's eggs by eating parasites? Oh, oh. Wait, do the tarantulas eat the parasites for the frogs and protect the frog's eggs? You're very good with your hands. That's a good skill to have. I am not very uh, dexterous. I do not have very good dexterity as I have um, further realized by building a PC. <laughs> I've used- I've been like screwing stuff in and the screwdriver keeps slipping because I put too much force. I'm kind of a brute force person. I have to learn to not apply so much force. Tarantulas protect the frogs while the frogs protect the tarantula eggs. Oh, okay. Sometimes okay, but mostly shite. Yeah, like okay to, enough to like play games sometimes and... Where the fuck is this girl? I'm gonna be so happy when we find her. Cause that's what we need for the next event. Is there an effect that attracts people? 
There isn't, right? No, there isn't. Oh, so you've learned to work with your sh your shaky hands? That's good. Yeah, I have pretty pretty shaky hands too. guys in here. Doodle, do you do VODs of your streams? Oh, what do you mean? I... There are VODs on my Twitch channel, and then I... Um... You can probably find them. And I do upload VODs on my YouTube channel, but those are like way behind right now. They're like a year behind, I think. <laughs> Cause I don't want to upload them all at once. But yeah, the, the Uke streams should be on the Twitch channel. On this channel here. If you just go to, what is it? The video tab on my channel and then past broadcasts. It should show the broadcasts for the last three months, actually. Unless I purposefully deleted it, it should be there. It's always on a super small scale, so I can't be shaking all over. Yeah, that's true. Square Doodles on my desk with Boomba, Spork, and Sakyo's head? That's so cute! I remember... I was so surprised to get, like, a sculpture of myself. It was so fucking cute. And so tiny, too. I was like, oh my god. How could someone do this so fine? Yeah, I've been, I've been streaming them every Friday. I think we've only done... This is the fourth stream. Fourth and last stream. Next week, we're gonna play Re-In. It's an English, uh, English Humaniki fan game? I believe. Oh my fucking god. <sighs> Thank fucking goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> I was expecting not to see her again. I was just wandering around. I'm in the middle of a tea party for Diz's birthday. Yeah, happy birthday to Diz again. I hope Diz is having a good birthday. Rian is really good. Yeah, I I saw the screenshots for it on the on the creator's Twitter, and it looks beautiful. So I wanted to give it a try. I am having a sparkling ice right now. I started getting back into drinking them. It's like a flavored sparkling water. Because my roommates bought like a whole pack of them and I was like, hey, I want it too. So I bought a pack Right now I have orange mango. It's really good Orange mango sparkling water And do miniature things because it takes less time that makes sense That, does, that makes a lot of sense Pog 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 pog. Oh, who this? I like how, like, other Yume Nikki fan games have, like, oh, there's a flower there. But no, it, there's this fucking weird creature here. Let's see. Speak to the NPC at the end. Go back out. You'll be transported to the ho hospital. Huh? We just came out from behind the vending machine. Oh, we don't have any money. Yeah. Ah, let's just sit your days for a bit. Yeah, show y'all some of my stuff, but it's mainly, un 
Uh, mostly Undertale. Yeah, did you say Undertale? I love Undertale stuff. <laughs> hey, Cries, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. I even like how the chairs are pixeled here. They're really nice. Okay, so y'all can judge me, but I haven't played Delta Rune Chapter 2 yet. I need to play Delta Rune Chapter 2. Maybe on stream, maybe on my own, who knows. I've been meaning to, but I've mentioned in the past that I tend to <laughs> I tend to like oh wow, what's going on here? I tend to like when something is really overhyped or like really super 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 popular, I tend to avoid it until the hype has died down a little bit. I don't know why. Maybe it's just because I want to enjoy it on my own without all the without all the like Opinions from everyone flying around. I don't know. Or maybe I'm a hipster. <laughs> Slightly traumatized by COS still, so I'm resting. I've got a lot of cake making to do. Yeah, I'm glad that you're taking a break for that, because yeah, uh, I know that's fun, but being able to tell when you need a break is good. What kind of cake are you making? Oh, it dark? Yeah, it is dark. There's a lot of beds with headphones on them, if you guys can see. And they are, they have computers on the sides. So, I mean, we have headphones. Nide does, she wears headphones like that. In the same way, but like the fandom is alive and well. Yeah, like it's fine if like the fandom is alive and well, it's just that like that initial release of Deltarune and like everyone was playing it and everyone was streaming it and stuff. I want to see you do chapter two first time. I love see people's new reactions to it. Maybe I'll do on stream. I'll have to make note of it. Del or put it on my game list. Deltarune chapter 2. Because I did enjoy chapter 1. So happy with my boyfriend. We were on a 2 plus hour call yesterday. That's really nice when you can like just keep talking and talking. And it, never, and it doesn't get old either. Oh, you're having internet issues? I sure hope that like the lag isn't getting bad. If it does, um, usually refreshing the stream helps, but... ASAP because of spoilers? Yeah, that that's a, another reason to... On the other hand, that's a reason to play a game right away when it gets circled around everywhere because it's spoiler territory. Yeah, you can request the, the wellness pack. It refreshes every 10 minutes, though. Ugh, stretch. Get some water. Yeah, and you and that's like I feel like that's a good thing. Like how your mind um kinda enjoys media as it's not really influenced that much, I feel, by other people's opinion. Play Undertale Chapter Four, please, please play Undertale Chapter Four. Play Undertale uh murder root. What, what What is that called? What is the root called where you kill everything? Also, hey, Bebop! You're so sleepy in ID Cave, I can't? Yeah, it, it's it's best to not push yourself with, uh, with streaming. Streaming is definitely a tiring thing. Well, depending on who you are. Yeah, that's true, Zizon. Since you're, like, right in the fandom, you kinda... You can't just, like, unplug yourself. Monkey. Genocide. Piss aside. <laughs> What's piss aside when you, um, fart aside? Piss aside and fart aside. Um, uh, when you piss and fart. 
Just all the fucking time. Okay, so this is the, uh, this is like the area that we needed to get to. Now how the fuck do we get out? Oh yeah, you can request Delta Room, and that, that'll make sure that I actually play it. Because <laughs> I can put it on my list of things to play, but who knows when I'll play it. And usually when it's requested, I, may, I make sure to play it within the next few weeks. Okay, I think that's it with this area. Okay, so... I think there are two more events, and one of them is a pain in the ass because it's a random event that is determined it's determined whether you'll see the event um every time you go to sleep so if you can't if you don't um if you check and you don't trigger the event you have to wake up and go back to sleep i'll never say fart or shit the same again the game grumps said fart and shit yeah same for me i say fart and shit or like sh I, I do say fart and shit but it's making its way into my vocabulary. Going under the bed one? Oh, we already did that one. Um, well, actually, we haven't come across the sleep paralysis one. Because that is a random event upon waking up. That one is interesting. So we just have to keep going to bed and waking up again. Um, there is... Blah, 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 looking down the list. Okay, nighttime beach flight. There's actually a few more events, but they're all... Two of them have to do with um, waking up, like a chance of waking up a certain way, which is a bit more tedious to get. Oh, you didn't have uh, sleep par paralysis happen to you? I like how our TV is just constantly on in the real world. Okay, so... We have to go to the area where we got the bucket, which is the beach. How the fuck... Do we get there? Where is the bucket effect located? Enter the first door. Okay. This is a bucket. Sleep calluses? Oh my god, how do you get calluses in your sleep? Slip. Most surefire way to get sleep paralysis is to go to sleep. Stop working. Climb down ladder, go left. Okay. I have to go. Hope everyone has a wonderful night. Yeah, I hope you have a wonderful night too, Asriel. Thanks for stopping by. See, we go down here and get to the street. Oh, we have to go to the concrete teleport maze. Okay. We have to go to that one teleport maze that I've got really lost in. I haven't played this game enough. I mean, obviously, we've only streamed, streamed it four times, streamed it four times. Um, but we haven't played it enough for me to get a good idea of the layout of the worlds. Like, 
Y'all have seen me play Yume Nikki. Well, some of you. And some of y'all have seen me help guide Cabal through Yume Nikki. So I know Yume Nikki's layout pretty well. Um, but compared to that, I, I know almost nothing about the layout of this of this place, of uh, New Day's Dream World. Yeah, I hope it does get an ending too. I hope it does, but alas, the fate of many Yume Nikki fan games is to not have an ending. Having you as a guide was very fun. I'm glad. I'm glad. It was very fun to be the guide. Very chill on your stream. I do hope that we can um, do one more stream where we... Did we need to get one more effect? We might have. And then see the ending. But I don't know how long that stream would be. Because we literally only have to do like two more things, I think. Let's see, uh, go right. Always choose the left one, okay. Yay! Okay, so we failed the check. We failed the vibe check this time. Okay. So there's a one-eighth chance. <laughs> oh, you want to know how fucking frustrating this chance is? So there are two things that we can see. One is that the beach will be nighttime. It's a one-in-eighth chance that will be nighttime. Then there's another one-in-eight chance within that one-in-eight chance that one of the barriers on the left side will be gone. So you can go to an under construction area. But apparently once you let it become nighttime, it's permanently nighttime. You don't have to re-roll that chance again. So let's try doing that. We can always finish it and switch to something else. That is true. That is very true. We can like figure out either an activity to do or a game to play together. Or maybe like you can play a game and I'm just hanging out. There's a lot of things we can do as long as we are together. It is always nice spending time with you. <laughs> as a shiny hunter, this is child's play. That is true compared to shiny uh, odds. Compared to shiny Pokemon odds. Uh, this is- this is fucking baby stuff. Baby chances. Which is why I do not do shiny hunting. I do not- well one, I do not enjoy Pokemon enough to do shiny hunting. Two, the chances are... eh. <laughs> and then there's runescape. And then there's RuneScape, as Bebop has described previously in the stream, the chances of dropping certain things. By the way, have you been- have you played RuneScape recently, Bebop? I remember when you f were first talking about those chances, you were like, grinding something. I remember you, you mentioned you were grinding something in RuneScape. Every single day? You play RuneScape every single day? Oh my god. Pokemon games and Breath of the Wild. I need to get a new PC first. Isn't... Oh, okay. So it's like, instead of buying those games, you want to buy a new PC? Because I was like, wait, aren't they on the Switch? But then again, yeah, new PC. Wait. Yeah, I need to... I want to get back into playing Breath of the Wild. I only played it a bit... Well, I played it a bunch on the Wii U, and I played it a bit on my Switch. The Wii U version being, uh, Draken's version. Okay, time to roll it again. I think I know the way, so I can... Slash. 
sleep paralysis happens. Okay. They on the they are on the Switch. I have them, but my computer is too old for me to stream Switch games. Oh, okay, so it can't even it can't even handle like capture card like processing signals from a capture card. If I'm understanding that right. You need to get back into it. Yeah, I remember what was that? Last year? Last year for your birthday. I don't know why I remember this so well. You got Breath of the Wild, right? And then I guess you were playing it then? I remember you talked about it in stream. No, this is not stream from the new PC. Um <laughs> I will be bragging about it so much once I actually start streaming from the new PC. But my PC is almost finished. I just need to put the GPU in. And plug it into power into the PSU. And then do some tests on it and it'll be good! I'm so happy. It's really... It, it's... I, I've gotten help from... Uh, a few people, including Bebop, for um, suggestions for this build, so I expect it to be a lot better leagues above what I'm streaming on now. I don't know if it'll be noticeable from you guys, but it will be noticeable for me. And when I actually try to do multiple things at once during stream, y'all don't have to watch my computer as it shits itself. <laughs> This PC is- it's before HDMI cords? Oh my god! Yes, you do need a new PC. I'm so sorry, Zyzon. You got it for your birthday? Yes! I remembered it right. You wanna get an Elgato? Some good cards so I can stream Nintendo Switch games? Yeah, I have an Elgato and it's really good. It just has that- that freaking uh, blue screening problem. Where if you close an application that's using the Elgato, it'll blue screen your computer. And it's happened to me several, several times. It doesn't- oh my god. You have to keep re-rolling. Yeah, blue screens, so just a heads up. <laughs> just do not- just uh, only plug in the Elgato when you need it. And as soon as you're done. Um, I forget if it also blue screens if you like unplug it while you have the program open. But yeah, just something to expect. If, if it blue screens after you close OBS or something. After streaming a Switch game. That's probably why. After I get affiliate done, I'm gonna try to do a donathon to raise money so I can get one. I wish you luck with the donathon. I might, I might stop by, but no promises. It really depends on my schedule. But I like supporting friends. I hope we get it this time. I hope we get it this time. At least it isn't a sh uh, long path. We don't have to go through the hell maze. A multi-day thing because I get so tired. Yeah, take things. It's good to take things at your own pace. I think I remember. Um, who was it? Pinkberry. Pinkberry um, was also doing a subathon, or it, this is different from a donathon, but it, it's like similar. And uh, they split it up into multiple streams because they also get tired from streaming. And I think that worked out well. I think it's a good idea. I might have to... If I ever do a subathon, I'd have to look into it myself. But... I honestly don't... I don't want to ask for money from people, mostly because I'm doing um, streaming for fun and two, not to brag or anything, I, I don't really need the money, 
So I feel I don't want to ask people for money when I can just buy it myself. Since, as you guys may know, I work a software engineering job, and those typically pay well. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is the sleep paralysis. Okay, well, we got that event. And also, hopefully, uh, we won't be seeing... If, if you see the, the uh, screen moving around and her taking forever to get out of her chair, that will be a lot more instantaneous in Yume Nikki fan games, where there is a moving image, it would actually run. I love small streamers so comfy. I agree. I do like stopping by small streamer streams, and especially friend streams. Very comf. The Elgato blue screen thing doesn't happen universally? Only on some computers? Okay, maybe... Maybe it won't happen on my new one. Hopefully. Hopefully. I'm 1%. Uh... No, probably... I don't think so. No. No worries if you can. I would save for it, but it's hard when most... My friends go to small? Oh yeah, that's absolutely fair. I'm just saying, like... You... Have a kid that you need to support. You have all these other expenses. I imagine you're not making... Um... I don't want to assume, but I imagine you're not making, like, a software engineering... A, new, a software engineer salary? Plus, raising a kid is just really expensive in itself, even if you do make a good salary. Uh, so, like, you're totally fair in, like, asking for money, because it really would help you, right? For me, uh, it would be like asking for something I don't need. Uh, I just feel bad for it. <laughs> Not the one percent. The millionaires, the billionaires. No. Uh -huh. Small child. No way I'm paid per story. Yeah. Like, like that's actually going, like if you did a, a donathon, that's actually going towards a good cause for stuff that would actually be really hard for, for you to, you would have to save up a lot and for a while. <laughs> yeah, crotch goblins, AK money pits. I, I am a uh, single, I do not have, I, I am with Draken, but like, I do not have a child I need to take care of, and all that shit. I live with roommates who help me pay for my rent and utilities, so. There it is. It is nighttime. I checked, and for me to save it up, it would take two to three years. Yeah, so like a donathon would really help, especially spending two to three years with your current laptop would just be oof. Okay, now we need to roll again for these things to open up, but at least it'll still be nighttime. Pog. And I don't want to like. So even if, say, like, you did make a good salary or something, everyone has their own reasons for, like, doing subathons, donathons. I don't judge them for it. It's just that me personally, like, I absolutely, everyone has their own situations. Even if they are good financially, could absolutely buy the thing themselves. Um, it's just, that, that's just my decision my thoughts on doing it myself. I would not put push my how, how would you say it? My preferences on other people. It blue screen my own seat mode? Oh my god. Ooh, I wish you luck in uni, Senti. Your first class is psychology? 
Psychology is really interesting. I wanted to take psychology when I was in college. But I just didn't have... Well, one, I didn't want to spend more money for an extra class, and two, it didn't fit into my curriculum. But I hope it's a good class for you, Senti. I'm not even think about thinking about where I'm going anymore. Yeah, yeah, no judgment. I have a bad history with psych majors, funnily enough. Oh no. Is it a long story? What happened? Oh, Senti, he probably means like, uh, people that he's known who were psych majors just ended up being assholes. Probably not that there's like, um, probably not like the, uh, he's probably not talking about like a stereotype that he has of psych majors. He's probably just talking about like every time he met someone who just happened to be a psych, psych major. It was not a good experience. They were not a good person. Okay, we need to do that again. It's kind of... Oh, okay. It's kind of like doing things over and over like this can be f calming to a certain extent. Especially when doing it in a humanity fan game. As long as you have the time for it. The last six or seven psych majors I knew were always trying to analyze me. Oh, they treated you like a guinea pig because of all your... Like, just because you tend to, you have more, um, uh, mental health issues, is that the right way to say it? More mental health issues than most. They're just like, ooh, let me analyze you, let me see, how do you act? Why did you, why did you turn out this way? That is a very crass way to say it, but I imagine that's kind of like how they treated you. Like, they didn't see you as, like, an actual person? Is, was that how it was? <sighs> it's interesting how the style from the sewers changes when you go above ground. One got mad at me for not- Fighting for the liberal cause. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that I'm literally disabled. What the fuck am I gonna do? He was like, wow, super disappointed in that self victimization there, buddy. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Oh my god, yeah, you deserve that head back, Cabal. Yeah, that sounds like a real uh, fine grade asshole right there. Self-victimization. But you literally... Uh, shoot him out for two hours for that end of the friendship right then. They're good. Like... Like, there, like there are instances where someone can say something kind of insensitive and... You know, you can talk it out and they'll be like, Oh, I see how that... What? How that was insensitive. I'm sorry, and you know, you make up. But that right there is just like, ugh. Wait, what? Why is it not nighttime again? Wait, what was I saying? Um, but sometimes people just say shit, and there's no redeeming it. Yeah, they're the reason we need therapy because they're not understanding. Yeah! I'm glad that you're surrounded by better people these days. 
And also, Senti was the what the fuck to this turning back to daytime. Because I agree, what the fuck? We were supposed to, after you got the nighttime roll, it was supposed to stay nighttime because the whole thing with the, um, the barriers opening up is that it has to happen during nighttime. So you have to get two rolls correct. Two one out of eight rolls for each one. Which is like a one in, in 64 chance. Oh my fucking god. If it if it goes back to daytime again for the next time I'm there, I'm just gonna give up on that because it's it, it's not even a completed area that we're going to. It was just gonna be like a, a, a nice to get to. Yeah. After the oh my god, it's a one in eight for it to change the daytime. What? It'll change back. Also, hey Diz, happy birthday! <laughs> welcome, welcome. You came as the game pulled a what the fuck on us? Because <laughs> I thought that something was gonna happen. You said it as a joke. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's not actually like confirmed or anything. This game getting on my last nerve, I swear. I'm scared now. I'm scared too, Senti. <laughs> I hope you've been having a good birthday, Diz. Happy cake day. Also, I don't even like have to look at the map anymore. I've just kind of like memorized this route now. It's pretty simple. But after this, we got the sleep paralysis, so I can close that out. Um. And then there's another one that just happens when we wake up. Hopefully we come across it while trying to get these rolls. Though then you spell it out? Well, stream stream has actually been going really well. Like we've been chilling and chatting. <laughs> but it's just that right before you came, the game decided to be like, nope, we're not gonna act like how you thought we were gonna act. Uh tough luck. Yeah, that's Senti, and Senti is actually the reason we're playing this game on stream. Because Senti was like, this game is really good. And then that just stuck in my head. I, I, I almost forgot that was Senti that recommended this game. I was like, hmm, there's this person who said this game was really good. Oh my fucking god, why is it daytime? <laughs> okay, one... One last thing. Let's try to get the other event that isn't based on a uh, random chance every time you sleep. Because this one is, uh, is a fun event. This is so sad, gamers. Can we hit four likes? Subscribe, hit that notification button. <laughs> Alright, so let's see... How do we get here? I'm looking at the guide right now. Tough shit turbo. We're gonna go really, really slow. Are you talking about when I get into my chair? Into the desk chair to save? Yeah. Hopefully that, um... Hopefully that doesn't happen on my new computer. Okay, so we go into the third door. Okay, we need to go on the subway. Okay. I think I got it. Like, this is an RPG maker game. Game? Please. You're supposed to be able to run this. Talking about the game refusing to go to nighttime. Yeah, that too. Oh yeah, I forgot to ask. How's it going, Diz? Feet.
Look at all these people. Just got done with a tea party, about to play Fall Guys with Eidolon? Oh, that sounds really fun. Gabal mentioned the tea party, and that sounds really fun too. Like, I got a picture of the tea party before. Those snacks look really tasty. What kind of tea did y'all drink? Oh, nice! What did you buy? It was decaf Earl Grey. Earl Grey's good. Oh, you sent a pic of this one's in the DMs. Okay, I'll take a look at it later. I'm hype. Yeah, I'm glad you're having a good birthday, too. It's always nice when a day that's supposed to be good ends up being good. What are the chasers in this game again? I have no idea. They, they're just like under sheets. And they have like weird... Like weird hands poking out. Yeah, they look like bloody ghosts. I feel like they're like cer a certain type of creature or something. Like not human. Two DLCs for dead cells. Panzer, Dragoon, Underleaves, and Lowell Mounces... Mounces... Why can't I say it? Mouse's Encyclopedia Moonlighter. I have not heard of any of those, but I hope they're fun. Time to have a little nap on the train. <sighs> have some of my orange mango ice. Frog yawn. Hey! Are you trying to wake me up? Trying to keep Nide from going to sleep in her dream? Orange mango sparkling ice sounds good as fuck. It is good as fuck. It's so good. Dead Cells is a fast paced broke like that's one of my fave games. It has amazing art and satisfying mechanics. Let me see. Maybe? <laughs> you know Cabal is gassy. Yeah, better out than in. Nide's falling asleep. Go to sleep, girl. You know you wanna. Dead cells. Oh my fucking god. I remember this has static. Is it gonna jump scare me again? I should turn down the volume. Had to wait a little bit more, I think. <laughs> Panzer Dragoon for the Switch is a remaster of an older rail shooter where you do where you pilot a dragon. Under leaves and little mouse's encyclopedia. Are super duper cute. That they do sound cute by the title. You're a mouse. Oh, that sounds really nice. Yeah, I, I do like this event as well. 
Moonlighter is a pixel art game. You can dungeon crawl and sell weapons in a shop you own. Oh, that reminds me of uh, Reset Tier. Reset Tier. The item shop. Item shop's tail. Like the premise? Kind of reminds me of that. Those all sound like interesting games. All oh, giving each other head pants. Yeah, Reset Tier. Come on, Nire. You need to give me the nightmare again. Cause I, I think you have to see the that scene in order to get to the next area. Thank you for the hat <laughs> He thank you. He does have a big brain. He's adding everyone. I find I find that there's like a theme with like Nide being surrounded by dolls of some sort. Big brain, bigger heart. That's right. Okay, and I think we need to wait. From what are your lord? More theories of this game? That was a good question. Okay, there it is. It's stopping. Um, I feel like Nire was part of an experiment of some kind. I feel like either an experiment or some kind of like like plague happened that turned people into weird creatures. Sort of like that one theory video, that one music video theory video of Yume Nikki. Some kind of like alien virus. There are a lot of like weird alien looking creatures in this game and like alien looking environments. <laughs> or both those theories could be true. She could also be part of like an experiment of some sort. Because there are, like, laboratory areas. We did not go to this area when we first came here. The roof... Or did we? We might have been here, but we just didn't have the right effect to trigger the event. Well. This is like the witch flying event in Yume Nikki. It, it, it do be bopping. It's good music. Oh, there's a girl up there. I didn't notice that before. You can only see her when you're like right next to the door. Huh. Was she there before? No, she's only there after you do the event. Huh. Uh, Karakasa. The tune was very nice. It was a bop. The sound design in this game is very good. Alright, so. That was the last, like, full event event. 
Uh, next one is another thing that happens like right when you wake up. The other thing is the beach. That is the last thing on the wiki that we need to do. So <laughs> she seems to appear in other places. Someone important, maybe? Yeah, I think I've seen her in other places before, or some similar. <laughs> you you really know how to put the tune in tuna. I do. Oh wait, did I just change out of that? Alright, let's go check the beach again in this stream. So basically for the rest of stream we're gonna <laughs> We're gonna be trying to roll this event. And the other one too, the one where you wake up, since we're gonna be waking up a lot. I I assume. What? I almost thought that there was like a bug on this hand, but no, nah, it's just like chewed out. Hand. Hand. Hey, 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 do you need a hand? Preferably, preferably one still attached to someone's body. And not having been taken a bite out of. <laughs> oh yeah there is one more thing actually there's like a menu theme that we can unlock but honestly I don't care enough it's gonna be way too grindy to unlock it it's like a what what menu theme is it it's a bread menu theme that you unlock by collecting pastries from the vending machines. So you basically have to like grind money and uh, and then try to get all the pastries, uh, all the 12 types of pastries from the vending machines. Yeah, it's just a menu theme, so. I don't really care about it that much, honestly. Nighttime, baby! Is it gonna be open? No? Okay. Okay. You better stay nighttime. It better stay nighttime, I swear. Okay, so apparently, apparently, so I read the wiki wrong. So once you unlock both at the same time, nighttime and the barrier is gone, then it's locked. Like then you don't have to reroll. But you have to like get the one in 64 chance that they are, that they roll together. I think, I, if I'm reading it right, because it says, after unlocking the nighttime scenery and the barrier, they are permanently unlocked and you do not have to reroll to get them again. I think I just re misread it before. So, we might be doing this for a bit. If we don't end up getting it um, by top of the hour, 10 p.m. my time, it's like 9.30 right now, um, I'll just end stream there. Oh, what? No. It's like Uboa, but a lot more annoying, because with Uboa, you could just go out of the area and come back. This, you have to, like, wake up and go all the way back there. Yeah. Because, like, I want to be, um... I want to keep today's stream to about two hours, because I want to have enough time to finish building my PC. Same time zone, yeah! EST! Who bought with 50 more steps? Yeah. Quite a bit more steps. If you're talking about steps to get there, the steps that you take on this car. 
<laughs> what time for you, Fong? It is 9.30 p.m. It can take quite a bit to get these rolls right, so I honestly could see us not getting this in 30 minutes. But we'll, we'll see. You'll, you'll keep me company, right? You're an hour behind. Yeah, I think then you're on the same time zone as Cabal. Well, actually, wait. The the one that Cabal's usually on, but right now he is in my time zone. Yes. Good old one hour behind the frange. Thank you! Hmm. Keep me company as I go through hell. <laughs> go through hell re-rolling and re-rolling the chances. Oh god. Does it have to be like... Does it have to be nighttime for this to be gone? Getting hungry. I had instant ramen for lunch. Yeah, that's not the best. Uh, it doesn't keep you full for very long if you eat instant ramen without any like meat with it. We'll go through hell together. Yes. Oh wait, what kind of instant ramen did you have? I like instant ramen. We march through hell with the trembles of potential demon-killing ferocity. Potential demon-killing ferocity. Yes, we can potentially kill a demon, maybe. Shiitake, shiitake mushroom with chicken ramen. Ooh, that sounds good. Did it actually have, like, mushrooms and chicken in it? Or was it just, like... Those, like, really dried up things that don't even really count as meat. Because I've had, like, frozen instant ramen before that's, like, you put it in the freezer and it actually has, like, vegetables and meat in it. But those are a lot more expensive. If they are polite, they see me come. If they misbehave, then you get... And mushrooms with no chicken, aww. So it was just chicken flavoring. Unfortunate. They are and I love them. You like having them too? It was the Aji, Ajinomoto, frozen ramen, the chicken shoyu ramen. Is that it? And they get the anger hands. <laughs> Kind of makes me want to get some of them in my new house, because my mom would be the one who bought them. But now I don't have them. Pretty sure yeah, I only get them sometimes though. Yeah, just because they're so expensive. And also like, obviously, even though they're frozen, they still have a shit ton of sodium in them. Might get myself a tuna sandwich. Ooh, tuna sandwich is good. It's like Doom Slayer, but no items needed to tear a demon apart. My hands hands are even angrier. I believe it. I believe that you do, you go all, like, what is it called? You go all sicko mode when you get angie. They do have good veggies. I like their bell, I like the bell peppers and the corn. Are there any corn lovers out there? I love corn. Like, if I go out to eat ramen, I always ask for a side of corn. I honestly kind of want to try corn on pizza, too. I haven't tried it before. 
You love corn and small does too? Good. You have good taste. Corn is so good. Maybe it's because I grew up, like, eating a lot of corn. Like, uh, when I was little. Whenever we had corn in the cob. Because I was so small, my mouth was so small, my mom would, like, cut the kernels off the cob for me and put it in a little bowl. I liked eating it like that. I was a spoiled kid. <laughs> yeah, grilled corn? Nice! Grilled corn is good. Eating it straight off the cob? Mmm. Corn on pizza is tasty. I really want to try it. Maybe one day in the next time I order a pizza. Which is not very often. I do not get pizza very often. What's it? Elotes? 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 What's that? You were shown that you could cut the kernels off. Biting off the cob always hurts your teeth. Oh, I see. So it like helps you a lot. It is easier on your teeth. And plus you don't really get, um, oh, what do you call those? The stringy bits in your teeth. And you have to pick it out, or floss it out. And it's a lot easier to mix it with butter that way too. You can just mix it in the bowl with butter. Oh, like literally today. <laughs> this is a very uh, per uh, a, a very. Very good timing for this conversation. It's corn that's got mayo sprout? <gasps> it's salty cheese? Oh my fucking god, that sounds good. It's salty cheese, some spice, I can't remember the name of it. I never thought about putting mayo on corn, but honestly that sounds good. How do you think they made loose corn? What's loose corn? Like just like cutting it straight down on the side. Cause how my mom did it, she would cut it straight down and it wouldn't take the entire kernel off. There would still be a tiny bit left. I guess I never made that connection actually. I'm a little hungry. Kind of want chips. Or something else. <sighs> you should try it sometime. I should write it down. It'll test. Yummy. When don't you want chips, my round friend? Honestly, never. I always want chips. But I know I shouldn't eat them all the time. I always imagine it would, sh it would save off cob bits or it'd ruin the kernel or something. Oh, okay. Like you would get parts of the cob or like you wouldn't get the whole kernel. But I'm glad you learned it rather than not. Be here for a while, aren't we? I'll see how long my patience lasts. We'll see, we'll see how long. I can deal with you, game. Make me go back and forth just to see a, a under construction area. Actually, it's not making me, I'm doing this to myself. 
<laughs> I'm doing this to myself. This game didn't hold me at gunpoint and say, you have to see all of the events in the game, otherwise I will kill you and your loved ones. Honestly, it would be easier to explain if it was that. But also a lot more anxiety inducing, so I'm glad it's not. Ah. Sniff. So yeah, there's just uh, the beach and then the the path to the under construction area and then also the last event is you wake up with your headphones kind of messed up. Like cricket on your head. Which is neat. It's kind of like, uh, I don't think you experience this in Yume Nikki Cabal, but there's a chance where if Marotsuki wakes up she has a crick in her neck. Where her her head is facing um, to the side of her body. So if you like face, if you like go left, her head faces towards the player, and if you go forward, her head faces like to the right. Yeah, it's just kind of like ah, uh, slept kind of funny. Nide does sleep with her headphones on. Wild. I don't know if the... This thing being gone is only at night time. I think it is. Oh, my shoulders ache. Yeah. Thank you, Cabal. Oh, time to stretch. Oh, damn. You know that feeling when you, like, stretch and then you can feel, like, the blood flow just opening up a lot more? You can feel, like, pressure leave your head. Thank you for the hat pat! I needed the water, too. Like, damn. When you hold so much stress in your body. I was, uh... Talking with my therapist today. I have therapy, uh, like, before stream every Friday, so you might- On Fridays, you might hear me talk about what I talk to my therapist about. But, um, she was teaching me, like, muscle- muscle relaxing exercises, like deep breathing stuff that I can use. And it helped a lot. Although, obviously you don't stay relaxed forever. I quickly started, like, like, tapping my foot and, like, getting, like, uh, uh, what was it? Tensing my shoulders again? It's my shoulders that get really tense. Uh, my core and I guess my calves because I, I like tap my foot a lot. Fronge must have water? Yes, I must stay moist. Y'all ever have that feeling where like, usually this happens when I'm like asleep because I go long periods without drinking water when I'm asleep. But that feeling like when you wake up, your eyes are so fucking dry. You take a big swig of water and then you can just feel your body just like becoming hydrated again. Like your eyes start like have start watering and like your lips are less dry and stuff. Or maybe am I just really dehydrated? That could also be it. I've been told that. I am dehydrated. Good thing this is a really easy path. 
You just keep going left. And then just follow the line. Franji, you drink more water? But if I drink too much water before bed, I need to pee. Yeah, pee. When I wake up and I haven't had enough water, I do feel dry. Yeah. I'm glad I'm not alone, but... <sighs> Maybe I'm an IRL frange that needs to see moist. What are you saying? I am an IRL frange. Go pee f before you go to bed, but the thing is, I need to, like, pee a lot. Like... Like, if I drink water- if I go pee before I go to bed and I drink water, I'll, uh, with the amount of time that takes me to sleep, which is, like, 30 minutes to an hour, I feel the need to go pee again. And then I, I, it's just annoying me to get up when I'm trying to go to sleep. When I'm like in the process of falling asleep. I do try to stay hydrated though. Try to beat that, that body. <laughs> try to beat the pee making. The pee making timeline. At least it's not as bad as my mom. My mom has this thing where she like wakes up and needs to go pee a lot all throughout the night sometimes. I hope I don't end up like that, but honestly, who knows. Yeah, the urge to piss keeps me awake if I'm trying to sleep because it's not necessarily like, well, part of it is the uncomfortable feeling of needing to piss. The other part is like, what if it gets worse? Like, what if I wake up and I'm like, I really, really, really need to go pee, like, to a really uncomfortable, um, extent. And so it's that ex anxiety that, like, keeps me up, and I'm like, me trying to decide whether to go to the bathroom or not. Ah. The brain is great. I love my brain. I love my body. Hydrate throughout the day and get all your piss out before bedtime. Yeah, that's usually what I try to do. I have like this big 32 ounce water bottle, like reusable water bottle, that I uh, usually refill throughout the day. So I drink at least 32 ounces of water. Which is pretty good, I think. Maybe my body just like... Like, I tried to, like, get a test for, like, my kidneys and stuff. I was thinking maybe it just doesn't process what I drink correctly, and it just goes through me really quick. But no, there's nothing wrong with my kidneys or anything. I'm... <laughs> I do have the best kind of body round. That is true. Oh, to be a round frog. It really is the life, I can tell you. Oh, we've been doing this for over 20 minutes. Honestly, this isn't even... This isn't even the worst thing compared to, like, RuneScape. There's round frange, but also cube frange. That is true. There is cube frange. I'm drinking half the ideal amount of water per day? Really? Wait. I need to drink more than that, but one of my doctors said that... Um... What is it? 32 ounces is enough. Like, I shouldn't drink too, too much water. Really? Yeah, my mom has told me that I need to drink, like, a shit ton of water, but... Then one of my doctors told me that, like, that's too much. I have to- I have to double check that. But now you have me questioning, Cabal. <laughs> you can say the kidneys were just kidding. 
Like they took a look at the water that I drank and they're like, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, I'm not gonna process that shit. Go on through. Go to the piss, the piss section. Just kidney around. Wait, now that makes me want to look it up. Let's see. Recommended water intake daily women. Sedentary. Because I imagine if you're not exercising, you would need to drink less. It is! What? Yo. Okay, I am definitely not drinking enough water. 2.7 liters in fluid ounces. What? Or ounces. Not fluid ounces, but just ounces. Or is it fluid ounces? Is that the... Y'all make me question my health? I know- Yeah, I know, I know. I do trust you, but it's like, I've heard, like, mixed messages from, well, my doctor. 91 ounces of water. Okay, so I need to drink three of these things a day. Holy shit. Well, less than three. Like, a little bit less than three. Also, I think my 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 mouse is running out of battery. It's blinking a little bit. I just thought it was funny. I was like, "Yeah, I drink one of these a day." Like, I drink enough water. No, I only drink a third of the water that I need. <laughs> okay, I'm going to I'm going to try and fix that. Thank you for bringing that up, Cabal. I will be a moist frange soon. Oh god, I'm gonna need a piece so much. Drink one piss jug a day or you die. I mean, honestly, if you stay dehydrated for a fucking long time, your body will not function correctly. The way that you said that, Zyzon, Franja's ass will be so full of water. Well, I'm gonna, like, do a fucking... What is that called? What is that called? Where you, where you clean your ass? Um, I'm looking it up. Ass cleaning tool. Enema. Enema. Sorry, enema. An enema. Full, fill my ass with 91 ounces. <laughs> Just want you to have a chance to be healthy. The cake shakes and it sounds like water sourcing. Yeah, I thought of a totally different thing. Like, not the water in the ass cheeks, but water in the ass. That's way too much water. I feel like your, your intestines would just explode. <laughs> but. Yeah, I'm gonna do this a few more times and then I'll give up. Because it's almost 10. Oh my god. Stream elements! I know, it's not stream elements that does that. It's a uh, cloud bot. It's stream labs. One second. It should be working. Uh, what? Let me. Let me look at the bot. 
stream labs. It just decides not to work sometimes. Cloud bot. Why is it turned off? It was turned off in the panel. What? Okay, let's try that again. Would you be able to do that again, Cabal, please? <gasps> Yo! Yo! We actually got it. Wait, none of it has been working? Wait, which commands haven't been working? Okay, this is it. Oh no. It turned itself off again! It like literally turned itself off before my eyes. One second. Yeah, shoutouts should be... Oh, you mean on Twitch? Well, I will try to add this manually. Yeah, this place is in need of updating, but let me let me at least add the quote manually cuz I don't want to like lose this quote. Add quote. Quote. Game is Uke. Added by Cabal the Raven. Got it. <laughs> and then it finally works. Well, um... Has it just been stuff that interfaces with CloudBot? With, um, Streamlabs? Because if Streamlabs is down... Um, the add quote command is done by Streamlabs, but shoutouts is done by Stream Elements, which is a totally different platform. So... I guess that's the good part about using multiple bots, is that... If one of them breaks, not all of my commands break. But yeah, we got it, guys! We got it! And now we just have to get that last one, which is like waking up with our... Uh, headphones... askew. But look, this looks like this could be like... This would be a really nice area. I hope it gets updated. Shoutouts have been completely non-responsive? Well, do shoutouts on her stream use cloud- do- do they use Streamlabs' bot? Because it could just be, um, because Cloudbot keeps turning itself off. The Streamlabs bot keeps turning itself off. Okay. Because I could see that being a, just like a Streamlabs issue. Okay, just time, time to like go to sleep and wake up like over and over. Oh, you can wake yourself up in real life. Usually that that menu option is is uh, grayed out. Oh, yeah, that really sucks. Streamlabs need to like needs to like get their shit together. Back to say hi real quick. Hey, Draken. Thank you for stopping by again. We were blessed with you twice. And I'll see if I can raid someone after this. Uh, once we get this. I don't know what the chances are of this, so we could be doing this for a bit. I don't want to be doing it for too long, though. Thank you, Draken! I wish you the best rest of the night, too.
But, uh... I may not raid anyone. We'll see. We'll see who's uh, streaming. Because I want to get, like, straight to the PC building, so I won't even have... I won't even be able to pay attention enough to, like, say hi to the person and, like, even say that I'm lurking or something because I want to go straight there. PC Frange! PC Frange! I will be PC Frange for the first time in my life. Well, did, uh, did my old house, did my, like, childhood house have a computer? I don't think so. I think... My mom used a laptop, and my dad used a laptop, too. Computer is frond-shaped. It's cube frond-shaped. It's totally my call. Yeah. I was just kind of thinking out loud. Wah, 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 wah. But yeah, thank you, Senti, for recommending the game. It was a good choice. Make cube fronge some chip? Yeah, maybe like like one chip or like a bag of chip. A bag of fly crisps. Yeah. Now I wonder why Nidae doesn't have headphones in her dreams. Really? That's really convenient, like tiny chip bags and sodas. Imagine the cute setups that you can make with that. Why does her why do her headphones have to stay so neat? You have an art hoard. You just have like a bunch of like different things that you could possibly use. Nida, you about to be getting on my last fronge nerve. Who the hell? Keeps their headphones so neat while they sleep. I I do sort of have an art hoard too. I have like this I have some bags in like this giant bucket full of art shit. It's still at my old house. Cause I don't really use <gasps> Okay, I think we got it. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> That's really messed up. And now she fixes it. Nice. That's funny. <laughs> I was expecting it to be like kind of crooked, not like totally on her fucking face. That was really funny. A desk, a big cabinet, and two rolling drawers. God, that's so much. And in your closet, too? <laughs> Alright, we are done with you guys. We have seen almost everything. Except for the menu theme. Yeah, the OST is good and the sound design is really good. Art everywhere. I feel like that's a, a nice way to live. Oh, that's pretty nice of them. Well, let's see. Thank you guys for joining us for the stream. I'm sorry I need to cut the conversation short. I would... Usually I would like to just, like, chat a bit more. But... I'm in a little rush. A little, little frange PC rush. Their art desk is a hundred year old? Still functioning sewing machine? Sewing machine desk? Damn. 
But your webcam isn't very good. And you do mostly traditional, right? So you would need the webcam. But yeah, thank you guys for coming. Thank you guys for joining me. For the Uke streams, we'll be streaming another Yume Nikki fan game next week. Thank you for that, Pat! Actually, I do need to piss and then do the PC. <laughs> Cabal, you predicted it. <laughs> but thank you guys for joining. We'll be streaming again tomorrow at 2 p.m. Uh, we'll be finishing up the visual novel that we were playing. Hopefully we can finish it up tomorrow. I have like a bunch of stuff going on tomorrow, so um, tomorrow's stream might need to be quote unquote short, aka like two hours again, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, let's see who's streaming to see if I could like potentially raid, but let me see. Well, my phone is so fucking hot. What the fuck is it doing while I'm not using it? Uh, well, 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 okay, so no one who I like super, super want to raid is streaming, so I'll end it here. Thank you guys for coming to the stream. Thank you, thank you, and I hope you have a good rest of your night. You might, if I manage to, to finish the PC tonight, you might find a picture being posted in the Discord of me showing it off because I will be excited. Good night! Good night!